everyone and welcome back to my channel. So, one of the things you might not know about me is that I really love polos. And recently, there's been a brand that's been catching my attention. And that brand is Tommy Hilfiger. So, it might not be a brand that is really... I know it's pretty big and pretty well known, but it's not a brand that I usually shop a lot. But recently, this brand's been catching my attention. So, I decided, because I've had a Tommy Hilfiger polo a long time ago, I decided to buy another one and just try it out and see how I feel about it. So, that's what we're going to be doing in today's video. So, um, just uh, as an introduction, if you haven't seen my videos, my name is Josh. I usually do review videos. Um, if you like this type of content, make sure you like and subscribe. But in today's video, we're going to be going over Tommy Hilfiger and just uh, my reaction to this polo that I bought. Uh, I'll be sharing some of the other things that I have and just talking a little bit about it. So if you like this, make sure you like and subscribe. But with that, I'll be getting into the video right now. So, just to start off, um, I'm a, I, like I mentioned, I really love polos. It's one of the things that I actually have a lot of. So, uh, I just want to share a little bit about what I have here. So, Polo, Polo Ralph Lauren. Um, love this, love this brand. And the other brand that I really love is Lacoste. I really love their, their polos, their Piquet polos. I have one here. Um, I have another one here. Um, just to show you guys, and I have another one here. So I just wanted to re like emphasize that I really like their polos. Um, I'm a really big polo person, and I recently bought this one here. It's a Tommy Hilfiger um, polo, and let me show you guys. It's in a medium. I'm in a medium in most, uh, most clothing brands. This is a regular fit. Um, I got this one because it has a bunch of this detailing that I th just thought was pretty cool. This is like a Tommy Hilfiger uh, name on the, the placket itself. So when you do close it up, you can't really see it. But um, this also has this detailing here where it's white and red. And if you saw, it also says Hilfiger. Um, I don't pop the collar, some people might, but if you do pop the collar, it'll say Hilfiger on the back, which I think is kind of cool uh, to, start, to a certain degree. But um, I have to say that, you know, their logo is always quite small. So when you do see this, you'll just see this really tiny um, embroider right here on the front left. And the other thing that I did really like about them is that they have this ribbed cuff right here with uh, just some red here and on the other side as well. So let me just read off some of this description that's here. Uh, this is an M. It's made in India. I believe it's 100%. Um, I could be wrong, so I'm just checking for you guys right here. It, no, it is 100% cotton. And overall, I have to say that it's a really great uh, polo. Um, you can see here the additional detailing that they have, which is just uh, to reinforce it on the bottom. Overall, uh, really great. Uh, I have to say that it's a little, it's like this polo exactly. Uh, I usually just get like solid color polos, sometimes with designs, uh, but mainly solid color polos just with the logo on it. Um, I have to say that this one's pretty good. Um, at hiding all of the logos if you really wanted to. It's like that little surprise that you could show people if you really wanted to. But for the most part, it, everything is pretty well hidden. Um, even the detailing here, this is, I don't know if you guys could see it here. Let me try to zoom in. But the button itself also has the name, um, which is, I, I think, pretty good attention to detail. Um, I don't remember how much I actually paid for this. I believe I got it off Amazon as well, but um, I have to say, because polos I feel like are getting more expensive, um, I have to say I, I'm pretty sure it was less than 50 for this one. I'm pretty sure it was probably like less than 30, or I think it was like 30. But um, I have to say that it's really good quality overall. Um, but I wanna know your guys' thoughts about this. Uh, I have to say too, because I say it in almost every video and almost every comment and a lot of people ask me, especially when they, they view my, my videos and my content when they're buying for themselves. I'm 5'10", I'm, I'm about 170 to 175 pounds right now. 
I'm a, like slim to athletic build and I have to say that uh, this fits me pretty well but I want to know your guys' thoughts. I want to know if you guys uh, like this brand, if you guys have bought from them before. I want to know if you guys, what you guys think overall. Um, what do you guys think of this on me as well? I think that, um, honestly, I do like it. I haven't bought their brand in such a long time, but honestly, I'm, I'm turning around. I'm turning around and I've been seeing it everywhere. I've been seeing this brand everywhere for some reason. Um, but yeah, let me know your guys' thoughts in the comments down below. And again, if you like this content, make sure you like and subscribe. Um, and I guess that's it. Um, yeah, I'll see you guys in my next video. Okay, till next time.